Let's have a look around the IRENA General Assembly. And as we walk, you'll see just a huge, diverse range of different countries and representatives here. So dozens of governments at the ministerial level, uh, all in deep discussions about how to mobilize effective investment into the renewables industry. As I said, we work with IRENA closely on putting the narrative about benefits on access to clean energy, job creation, development, energy security that renewables can bring to governments and countries around the world. Yeah, so I think Abu Dhabi has really shown amazing leadership in terms of global renewables. Obviously, they host the International Renewable Energy Agency and many other really innovative companies uh, in general. And indeed, the United Arab Emirates has also really shown its leadership after COP28 Dubai and the establishment of the UAE consensus on tripling of renewables, doubling of energy efficiency. The huge breadth and diversity of um, people that I've been able to speak to, you know, from uh, ministers and policymakers from a range of different countries through to, you know, key members of our own supply chain who are represented here as well, who are really hands on in terms of the delivery of the infrastructure. They're all here, they're all talking, everybody's on the same page in terms of wanting to accelerate and get down to practical delivery. So uh, I'm hoping for more of the same through the rest of the week. Right now we are talking about the not only small grids, but, but to be sustainable, we need to have uh, battery systems, we need to have smart grid systems. So that's all that we are talking right now here, and hopefully we will be able to get a, a, a solution, on, especially on the documentation side, so that we can go to the developers, we can go to the finances with the proper documentation to implement the bigger projects in, in uh, our countries.